it feel to be back, Swish? Uh, feels good. Finally got my first practice in, uh, full practice, so it uh, feels good. You, you, you're questionable for the Detroit game. Uh, is it just to see how your body will respond to that, that full workout? Um, yes and no. Um, uh, I think it's just more or less my confidence of going into playing. Uh, one practice, uh, I mean, it's just, I don't know. I mean, the, it's really up to me, but I mean, it's kind of weird situation, I guess. What is the hurdle that you're trying to get over? Is, is it a mental thing? Is it a physical thing? Um, I mean, mental, uh, physically, I'm fine. Mentally, it's just uh, going in there, swiping at the ball, um, you know, trying to dive for loose balls. Um, that plays a factor, and uh, it just doesn't. You never really want to go into any type of game or whatever you're doing second guessing yourself. So, um, if, if I got to second guess myself, I, I won't play. If I feel like I'm not going to, then I'll play. Do you have any concerns physically, then, either uh, stamina wise or, uh, or with your thumb? Uh, stamina wise, I'm fine. Um, I mean, I've been working hard in the gym. Obviously, it's not the same as playing in a game, but. Uh, Stamina wise, I'm fine. Um, my thumb, it feels good. Um, it's just, you know, it's just mental now. Larry Drew told us that uh, you were shooting it pretty good out there today. Uh, when you had that layoff, how long did it take for you to, to kind of get that shooting rhythm and, and touch back? Uh, surprisingly, it didn't take me no time. Um, fortunately, I don't really use my thumb uh, on my shot. It's really all of my my other four fingers and my fingertips and wrist. Uh, so uh, my thumb is really just there to, you know, stable, keep the ball stable in my hand. Uh, but fortunately, it didn't really take me that long. The guys seemed pretty shocked by the, the bogey injury the other night. How did you guys respond as a group today? Um, we haven't, t I mean, we talk about it as individuals. We haven't talked about it as a team. Um, it's, it's extremely unfortunate for for both people, uh, or both parties, for us, obviously, because we need a big, um, but more importantly for him, because, I mean, he, he's looking at his potential title run, and uh, he can't compete. Um, and for that to, I mean, for him, if you get hurt any point in time, it's really tough. But for you get hurt 58 seconds, and it's like probably the freakiest thing ever. How tough has this season been just because you, you know, even starting out, you're starting off kind of slow and, you know, long layoff. It's got to be a challenge for you. Um, I mean, this has probably been one of the tougher years, uh, if not the toughest year f for me, um, on and off the court. Uh, I mean, it's just part of the process, I guess. Uh, I just, I think it'll just make the story better. Off, off the court, how's your family doing? Uh, they're doing good. They're doing good. Uh, my daughter's putting on a couple pounds, so uh, it's good to see. What's she up to? Uh, I don't know if my wife wants me to disclose oh, okay. that, so I'll, I'll let her. Is she, is she still in, in the hospital, I suppose? Or? Yeah, she's still in the hospital. She's, she'll be in there up until uh, two, two, to two weeks before or after her due date. So. So we should say how individually tough this has been for you this season. How about as a team, though? I mean, you guys haven't been whole yet. How difficult has that been? Oh, uh, I mean, it's, it's extremely difficult. Um, but fortunately, we're, we're a deep team, and we've got enough pieces to, you know, to get it done through the regular season. Um, it's it's going to be tough. I think the toughest part is, you know, once we get everybody together, getting everybody on the same page, uh, I mean, a lot of us play with, play with Kev for a couple of years now, and then guys who who just got here and haven't played with Kev and won't play with Kev until the playoffs. So, and uh, whether we try and get another body in for as a big, nobody's played with him. So, and, uh, D Will and those the two D Wills and Kyle haven't played with me. So it's like it's it's kind of tough. Uh, but the good part about it, we're all veterans. Um, so. It shouldn't, I would say it shouldn't be that hard, but I don't want to put my foot in my mouth. What does it say about your team, though, JR, that you've gone through all this, yet you still have the, 
the best record in the East? Uh, we got two two of the best players in the world, so we should be. <laughs> <laughs> Even though there are some more pieces to work in, and maybe a new one to come, and not when Kevin gets healthy, did today feel like a reset at all? Uh, it seemed like you had a long, long practice. Taking, uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, no worries. <laughs> Last to win? Yeah. Damn. Uh, it seems like you guys had an extra long practice. We haven't seen many practices, period, out of your group. Did, did that, can that help you know, get you guys back going? Yeah. Um, I mean, even though we're vet, we have a, a veteran team, we can always use practice. Um, it's kind of hard because um, we have guys who, you know, Brian Lee's league of minutes and Kai's played so many minutes and, um, it's hard because the guys that we do have um, need rest, but we also need to practice, and that's the we we all know that's the only way we're gonna get get the job done. Um, you can only watch so much film and uh, talk about schemes or walkthroughs until you actually get out there and play. And playing against one another is really how you get uh, really is how you get better. Um, I mean, yeah, playing. We got games on the schedule that you know we're gonna play through, but when we play in this gym. Uh, that's how you really get better. Do you think there's enough time to get where you guys want to be by the start of the playoffs? Uh, I think so. Um, again, I don't know what Kev's timetable is, so that'll be uh, different because we got to, you know, reacclimate him into the, into the lineup and, and whatever else. But uh, it'll be difficult. But I mean, being now three-one is difficult. So. <laughs> At what point did you feel like? You were nearing a return. Was was it when you were actually on the court, able to go through stuff pregame, or when did you get to that point? Um, when I was able to shoot, uh, I've always pushed. In this situation, I kind of pushed myself uh, to the limit. Uh, when I was able to shoot, and they told me not to dribble, I was dribbling a little bit. Uh, probably wasn't the smartest thing to do, but I know my body, so. Uh, Honestly, my, my confidence has gotten higher this last couple couple of days and um, being able to go out there and, and play the three-on-threes and pick up. So uh, definitely within the last couple of days, my confidence.